Yo, what is up, my knights of the round table? Welcome back to Music Night with the Knight. We got another animation versus anything of Eddie's rap channel. Blitzo versus Pico. This was a highly requested battle. Thing is, I don't know who either of these two are. <laughs> but, it don't matter. We're here to judge bars. That's what we're gonna fucking do. Eddie's usually really good about that shit, though. Like, Eddie can usually fucking... Break it down, anybody can understand it. Okay. Okay. Oh my god, dude! Oh! I've graduated. You just entered the school grounds. I'm ahead of you. You think you're tricky, but I'm the one killing you, clown. Clowns do tricks. Better can it fool you looking like Cassandra Jr. I'll blame and school you with my gang of shooters. Okay. When I make that AK pop. AK-47. Ain't no motherfucker. Ain't no motherfucker standing in Luna. Okay. They go at least ninety percent of you, the fans that viewed you. Okay, bro. Shit. He's like, okay, take out the stands. There goes ninety percent of your viewers. I'm dropping sicker shit than your daughter's syphilis. Ugh. Ugh. He hitting. He going dirty with it. He bringing the man's fam into this. Tell it what the fuck? <laughs> to let that dog to listen, see it. Shake a paw and hit send a hit. Okay, I love the little flow. Shake a paw. To our jaws, split the boot the bitch. Like our paws relationships. Okay, they always split up. And try it. It's silent. Okay, like your viewers, the O is silent. Sell this. This is fucking heat. I don't know who to go for. Oh dear God! Oh boy! This is a fucking battle, ladies and gentlemen. This is a fucking battle. We got a battle on our hands. Vietnam, maybe a demon. Your creator is fucked. 
What kind of freak Wait, thinks mm, Columbine. Columbine's not racist enough? He's like, I may be a demon, but your creator is fucked. Is not racist enough. <laughs> you fucking edge lord. Lord, that's just like a razor blade. And then one fucking blew up. You were too risque ris to play. You were too risque, okay. Risque to Till Ninja, Ninja Muffin said. Muffin said fuck, it, fuck it, let's just make him gay. Just make him gay. Sorry, your preference, babe. Sorry, your preference, babe, man, but not even your A's are straight. <laughs> Shit. Somebody, when somebody's, um... Somebody's heterosexual, they're, you know, the saying is just, you know, they're straight. Um, so it, since uh, Pico is gay, he's like, not even your A's are straight. He don't get straight A's, he's calling him dumb, and he's throwing in the gay bar as well. Not even your A's is so that's, that's really layered right there. Oh, you think I feel bad and comfort you through this? But you are an assassin, I don't get too shit. shit. It needs to be bad. Took the fast lane, I fucked your daddy. Now I'm outie. Daddy, daddy. That's a flash bang. You throw a flash bang, and you know, it bangs in a flash. He's like, I, I fuck your daddy and outie. That's a flash bang. It's a flash bang. Ooh, you're, the you're the virgin version. Virgin version of, the of the Chad. Peek on Joe. The virgin versus Chad meme. I tell you to go fuck yourself. You probably do. That's some shit I would say. That's like this is literally some shit I would say right there. I'd tell you to go fuck yourself, but you probably do. That's some shit I would say. Probably do. Although you're not who I pegged. You're not though. You're not who I pegged to try to top me. This is a sex bar, you know. Person getting pegs on the bottom. To try to top me, like really. Like Millie with a strap on in bed, like I said, it's a dirty bar. That takes moxie, kid. As the officer of your hood school, hood school I'd, like I'd like to hire you, to hire you. as my personal footstool. You my bitch. As my personal footstool. Take on this kid from Columbine. I'll stand you all in line. Add an AK-47, a revolver, a nine, a Mac 11, and it ought to solve the problem of mine. And that's your whole group of furry. Shout out to one more time, cause I'm Pico, the one and only. You were cheap clone me, like there's a roly. You left him behind and ran away from the sideshow. Now you're second fiddle to Aspen Hotel, still in the sideshow. Sister of rehab, so let's set the first in the press. And what's your job? I'm losing count of all the homes that you wrecked. Everybody that you mistreated has now scored you and left. And when you kill, not a single soul will be more than your death. Jesus, this is a battle. Like, this is what I love about rap battles. I've said it in thousands of videos. When I think of a rap battle, I want to see some hurt feelings. Nothing is off the table. Every little bad thing about you, every terrible thing that's happened, anything that's happened is on the fucking table. And this battle embodies it. Take on this kid from Columbine, I'll stand you all in line. Add an AK revolver at nine. A Mac 11. I'd have solved that. These are gun bars. Shot up all in one time. Call them furries. That's funny. You're a cheap clone of me. Like Fizzaroli. You left him behind, ran away from the sideshow. Now, now you're second fiddle to Has Been Hotel. Has been hotel still, still in the sideshow. He's like, you escape one sideshow into another. In the sideshow. Sister in rehab, so let's left. Sister in rehab, so let's left, divorce and depressed. Divorced and depressed and, what's your job? and with your I'm job, losing I'm losing count I'm of all the homes you've wrecked. He's a home wrecker, bro. Homes that you wrecked, everybody that you mistreated. Saying you're a dick. Oh, go cry to your Kickstarter, you precious nerd. I'm shocked you didn't add a stretch goal for that second verse. You should kill yourself now, you cringe ass nae baby. Like Darnell's. <laughs> Why is that funny? <laughs> I've never heard somebody say that. Oh, shit. Oh, 
I'll go cry to your Kickstarter, you precious nerd. I'm shocked you didn't add a stretch goal for that second verse. You should kill yourself now, you cringe ass nay nay baby. Like Darnell, I'm spitting fire. Don't play games with me. Ever since Tank Man invaded, your sight is tech, man. Nowadays, you're just some nostalgic hipster spank bang. Dip shit, you wasted my time. I hope you had fun. I damn your ginger soul to hell if you had one. So go cry to your Kickstarter, you precious nerd. I'm shocked you didn't add a stretch go for that second verse. You know, you stretched to go on Kickstarter. Not good. I love how there's a little YouTube frowny face over there. I love that. You cringe ass nay nay baby, dude. That's fucking insulting. Like Darnell, I'm spitting fire. Go play games with me. Ever since Tank Man invaded, your site's been tanked, man. Nowadays, you're just some nostalgic hipster spank bait. You had one. That was like that was like a gladiator battle. There was a lot of bloodshed. Now it comes to the time who I think won. I think Pico might have clutched it up in there in that second verse. I don't think Blitz Blitz's uh, second verse was as good as his first. I think the first verse they tied, and I think Pico kind of squeaked by on that second verse. I don't know. I I, I had to give it a re-listen though to kind of confirm my answer. But as of right now, Pico's my winner. Um. But holy shit, Blitz was fucking just a fucking savage in his first verse. Actually, I might give Blitz the first round uh, and give Pico the second round. I think they kind of tied here. I don't think there's really a true winner. Like, they did such a good job. Uh, by the way, this battle was an easy 10 out of fucking 10. <laughs> Diamond tier. This is one of the cruelest, most fucking dirty battles I've listened to in a good while. And I love it. I want more battles like this. I want more battles like this, damn it. I love battles that are just, just dirty. I, I, I love just vicious bars. So this really fulfilled me. So thank you guys so much for requesting this because I was really, I, I hadn't really thought much about this battle. Uh, and I now see I needed this in my life. And you guys looked out for me. So thank you. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this as much as I did. Go check out Eddie's channel for yourselves. He has a ton of great battles like this. And as always, I'll see you in the next one.